Oh, I wonder if hazardous chemicals has anything to do with old island operations or if they just keep hazardous chemicals back in here. Hey, here's a kitty cat. There's a cat back there. Meow. Hazardous chemicals, kitty. You should get awake fast. Hmm. Doesn't say radiation. I'm looking between the cracks. No, that's stuff they're using for this. Okay, I gotta sit here and get this beat up old building. Building 335, amazing how easy it was to find that. I'm sitting on a bench. Now, let's see what, I, what notes I have for building 335. Uh, 335. Got it written right here. Here's the map. C-335 on there. C-335 up there. So we had... Trying to keep it from blowing away or falling on the radioactive ground. The sheets of paper. It was training and used, wait a minute, 335 and 445 were used for training and storage. There are PCBs, TPHs, dioxins, pesticides, and then farther down the shoreline was the bus painting shop, and in there they had iron, benzo, a pyrene and uh, it looks like anthrax. Huh, okay. And those were in, in building 85 and 328, which is farther down the shore. Also, there was a gas station back there down the shore, too. Okay. But this is building 335, so I'm going to, uh, and then 445 is next to it. I think 445, the 445 was in, closer to the pandemonium. It was in the direction I was shooting a minute ago. And 445 had all that stuff on it. And I can't get in that yard, otherwise I could I could find 445. That had PCBs, TPHs, dioxins, pesticides. And that was uh, training and storage. Training and storage. I would also like to find building 3... Well, this is building 335. I wish I could find 85 and 328. I think they're in that yard there. Okay. Pretty sure it's in that yard. In that yard. 